While some modifiers act to create objects or modify materials, others can be used to edit the shape of objects. One of those modifiers is the chamfer modifier. The chamfer modifier is used to create cut or rounded edges on objects that you're building. While there is a chamfer tool within the Edit Poly tools, it is used as a modeling tool and cannot be modified once the chamfer is created. The chamfer modifier allows you to edit the parameters of the chamfer to make it either a broken corner or a nice rounded corner. In this lesson, you will apply a chamfer modifier to the lamp section in order to smooth out the corners along the seams of the smoothing groups. The smoothing groups determine which faces are visually smooth with other faces in the model. The lamp section object is created from two objects put together as a pro-boolean object with a taper modifier applied. Select the lamp section object. In the command panel, click the modify tab. Open the modifier list dropdown and click chamfer to add a chamfer modifier. With the chamfer modifier enabled, the results look rather strange. To fix this, the values for the amount, segments, and tension options need to be changed. The amount is the distance that will be chamfered from each edge along the adjacent surfaces. Set the amount value to 0.125 inches and press Enter. Change the number of segments to 3. Set the tension to 0.5. Now the result looks a little better, but there are still issues with parts of the object that are being chamfered that should not be. For example, all of the edges of the model are being chamfered at the same time. To fix this, you can use one of several options. The first is that you can use a selection of edges to chamfer only specific edges of the model. Open the selection dropdown and choose Selected Edges. Now only the edges around the Boolean cutout are chamfered. If you want to chamfer edges along the outside of the object, you need to select those edges. Open the selection drop down again and choose All Edges. Once again, all of the edges are chamfered. The Input Options group provides two methods for determining which edges are affected by the modifier. Since this object has clearly defined smoothing groups, use one of the From Smoothing options. Expand the From Smoothing dropdown and select Unsmoothed Edges. This now corrects the edges that should be chamfered by this modifier. Zoom in to the upper left corner of the lamp section object. Currently, the number of segments is set to 3 with a tension value of 0.5. Adjusting the number of segments changes the number of polygons used to generate the chamfer. The minimum value of 1 will make a low polygon clean chamfer. Increasing the number of segments will make the chamfer smoother and increase the number of polygons as well. Keep the segment value set to 3. The tension value determines the curvature of the chamfer itself. Setting the tension to a value of 0 will provide a sharp 90 degree corner. Setting the tension to a value of 1 will create a sharp 45 degree corner. Varying the tension value between 1 and 0 will create a smooth chamfer that will vary from 90 degrees to 45 degrees. Setting the tension to a value of 0.5 will make a nice rounded filleted edge. When you enable the open chamfer option, the chamfer is open completely, creating an open model. If all you want to keep are the chamfered corners, click the Invert checkbox that's just below the Open Chamfer checkbox. Turn off the Open Chamfer by deselecting the Open Chamfer checkbox. There are two different operations for creating the chamfer on the object. The Quad Chamfer option creates only four-sided polygons when dealing with multiple intersecting edges. This option also uses double the number of segments. In this case, it utilizes three segments from each edge instead of a total of three segments. 
switching to the standard chamfer, will cause the creation of three-sided polygons at multiple intersecting edges. The standard chamfer creates the chamfer by breaking the corner into the number of segments specified. At the upper left corner on the front of the lamp section object, the standard chamfer creates three-sided polygons. When you switch back to the quad chamfer option, the corners are created clean and free of triangles. The chamfer modifier can be a powerful tool in your modeling toolbox by enabling the creation of both chamfered and filleted edges as part of a parametric workflow. This allows you to make changes at any time in the modeling and animation process.